Hey guys, Ashley from Ash Cash Budget here. If you're new to this channel, I'm currently following the Dave Ramsey baby steps. I am on baby step number two, paying off about $42,000 in debt. So if you want to continue to follow me on my journey, click the little red subscribe button down below. Don't forget I have a 1000 subscriber giveaway video up and the giveaway is going until the 20th of December. So if you haven't entered, go and click the link. I'll put it up here, down there, something. I'm also doing Vlogmas, so my first video should be coming out today as well. I want to try to get this posted first and then that'll probably follow quickly thereafter. Today is my December debt snowball update. I think I did all right. I had to hold on to $1,500 for a medical expense though. So this is how much I was able to put towards it after having taken that out of my budget. I've slimmed down a little bit more on some of my other stuff and I think I did okay. I paid the $130 minimum payment which if this minimum payment has dropped off, it should only be $120.92. So, but I saw somewhere else it was a little bit higher. I don't know if these are getting ready to go up and I just haven't seen it reflected yet because every once in a while they bring it up because I'm on a graduated payment plan, which means that I had a 30 year plan and over the 30 years, the payments would continue to get higher and higher. So it might be that they went up, it might not. I'll reevaluate it over the next month or two just to see. And if it really has dropped lower than say 125, then I'll just lower my minimum payment to 125. I like to round to the nearest $5. So if that is the case, I will do that and put the extra $5 into my snowball. But for now, I did $130. So for my actual snowball payment on top of the minimum, I paid $740.96 to my smallest loan. If you'll remember, last month I paid off my first student loan, which is amazing, so I only have six left. So that payment brought me down to $1,734.78. And then everything else, I have on the next one $3,673.77, then $3,698.89, $5,367.29, and finally the biggest one is $7,019 and 33 cents. So they actually all dropped by a few dollars and I'm left with a total of $26,899.88. I'm into 26,000 now, goodbye 27,000. That means my total down for the month was $774.25 and for my whole journey I have paid down $15,388.41. Oh my God, I have reached $15,000 paid off in a year and nine months. That's a lot of money, guys. So the actual paid that I paid this month though, which is a snowball payment plus the minimum payment, I have actually paid $870.96. And over my whole journey, I have paid $19,830.22, which means over the last month, I lost $96.71 interest and $4,441.81 over my whole journey. That does make me hopeful for the future as far as paying off the rest of this $26,899.88. But I still feel like I have a long way to go. I was really hoping to put a lot towards it this month. And then that medical bill came in, which I'm still working through. So that $1,500 I put in my budget for it is going to stay there. Even though we're into December now, I'm keeping it from November. Just because December's income isn't going to be nearly as much as November. And I already put that money aside. 
So that is gonna stay there until I settle the bill and finish it out. And then anything, if I have anything extra, I'll put it towards debt. But I'm still trying to see what's going on with that, talking with the insurance and with the lab and all of that. Down here I changed the layout for, I guess the debt graveyard or something like that. I don't, I don't like this version either. I wanna do it justice to show off just how much I've paid by paying off these six other consumer debts but I can't figure out exactly the best way to show it and I don't wanna fill out the whole thing like I used to just because that's a lot of extra work. So I'll try to figure out some way to give that debt graveyard a proper viewing. This looks kind of sloppy here. This looks more neat, but I don't know if I'd like that either. I'm gonna change this layout I think next time. So watch that. And that is it for the month. Like I said, Vlogmas is coming up. Uh, I'm kind of nervous about it. Let me know if you like it and make sure you enter that giveaway. I will of course put the links up above to subscribe and another video that YouTube will suggest for you guys and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.